In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can use Tana's new AI chat feature to speed up how you get work done and possibly even cancel your ChatGPT premium subscription. Hey, my name's Evan. I create YouTube videos to help creative solopreneurs develop personal knowledge systems so they can think and create at their best. Now, I remember when Tana first introduced AI and I thought, I am never going to use that. But fast forward to just over a year later, and I use AI multiple times a day to get work done. In fact, it's become an integral part of my workflow in Tana. But up until the launch of Tana Core, AI was just hidden inside commands and fields and kind of simple queries. You really couldn't chat with your notes. But all that has changed with the introduction of AI chat in Tana. Now you can create a chat-like experience just like ChatGPT or Claude or Meta AI, and you can reference any notes from your Tana workspace. No more switching between your notes and your AI tool. So in today's video, I wanna cover how to use the new AI chat feature in Tana, how to query your own notes using AI, and some hidden AI features you probably aren't using that should be. Firstly, let's answer the question, why would you even want your note-taking app to be integrated with AI? That was the question I was asking before I had AI in Tana. But now I use it every day, I can see how better my workflows become now that I don't have to switch between two different apps, copying, pasting text, pasting it back into my notes. It means that I get to stay in flow more often get things done faster with less procrastination and less distractions. Now talking about getting things done faster in Tana, if you wanna speed up building a knowledge system with Tana, then you should absolutely check out my Tana Fast Track course. Not only will you learn all the ins and outs of Tana, but you'll get access to our core TFT templates that are really designed to give you a head start on building out your knowledge workflows. We've got templates for task and project management, your personal CRM, horizon planning, notes and knowledge, and content creation. So I'm gonna leave a link for it in the description and you can check it out. All right, so let's dive into how Chat AI works in Tana. So uh, when you're in Tana, you will see a little icon in your sidebar called AI Chat. Um, if you open it up, you'll actually see AI Chat, but if you've got it closed, it's just this little icon here. Now, you can just click on that icon and you get straight into the chat window and you can start to ask it questions just like you would in ChatGPT, in Claude, in Meta AI. It also has some kind of generic questions that you can just click on and um, it'll start it'll start the chat. Now, because I like to stay in flow in Tana, I don't usually open it up in a main window. So instead what I do is I control click the icon here. So if you hold down command or control, whether you're on Windows or, or Mac, and you click the button, you get it coming up in this side panel. This is how I use it almost 100% of the time uh, because I wanna stay in flow in whatever I'm doing in the main window. Okay, so it does act just like normal kind of chat AI um, apps. So we're gonna ask it uh, to write a haiku about how great Tana AI is. Okay, here's our haiku. So Tana AI shines bright, knowledge webs intertwine, wisdom at your call. Um, so you can ask it follow-up questions just by typing in here. You can also use some of these custom buttons. So if Tana gives you a whole heap of stuff, you wanna summarize it, explain it, continue writing. And so you, you just keep asking it follow-up questions until you get what you need. And because it's in Tana itself, all we have to do to get it to where we need it to go is just to hit copy and put it into wherever we are. If it's a note, if we're working on an email, if it's some kind of content, if we're working on an assignment, whatever it is, it's we can just copy and paste it straight over. Okay, so it's super easy to just start a chat in Tana and it works exactly like ChatGPT, but really, where the power comes in with having AI integrated into our notes is so that we can actually reference any note from within our workspace and use it to send off with the prompt that we ask it for. So let's have a look at how you can use your own notes along with chat AI to make some really fun stuff happen. So um, I have a whole lot of notes that I've taken from a podcast that I listen to, and I want to summarize some of the key points. So um, whether you're on just a single node, you can press AI chat, and then it will come up and it will automatically put that into your uh, chat box, okay? Um, 
Or if you want to do multiples, then all you have to do is select all of the nodes that you want, click AI chat, and then they're all in there. And so then we can ask AI to do something like summarize. Okay, so I'm basically just asking it to summarize these notes um, and list all the main points and actionable items. So once you do that, now you can either come down here and press send or uh, just press enter. So now we've got a bunch of main points that are summarized, ready for me. Um, and then also some actionable items. It was a podcast I listened to, so I might wanna kind of take some actionable items away. And so all I have to do here is go copy um, and I can bring this down into the bottom of my note. And now I've got something to work with. And you notice what happens is that um, it's, it's summarized a point and then it's actually linked me back to uh, wherever that is up here. Okay. Uh, let me think here. Yeah. Okay. So it actually references back the notes for you, which is really handy, right? Um, because if you ever wanted to know where this came from, um, and kind of follow that back, you can see it. Now I may not want to see the source for each of these. Um, and so that's why you can ask it follow-up questions. So I could say something like, great, but don't include any of the sources right uh, it'll go back and then now it's just going to give me a plain list okay um, which I can again copy um, and then paste over and then it's a little bit um, uh, easier to kind of read without all those sources in there now let's say that you're working with some kind of text so you're creating something now I'm a content creator, so I do a lot of writing, I do a lot of scripts, I do a lot of kind of stuff in time like that. Um, you might write things like emails, you might write reports, you know, all of those kinds of things. So you may not need to summarize something, but you might need to ask ChatGPT to help you with the writing of something. So let's say, for instance, I've got, you know, something that I'm writing. Um, this is a newsletter that I shipped a couple of weeks ago. Let's say that I didn't really like how this sounded. And just like we did, with our previous notes, we selected them and then asked it to summarize. We can do the same thing here with notes that we have uh, that we're that we're in the middle of writing. So, uh, if I want to, um, let's say, work with this particular text, I just select it and then click AI chat, and then I can ask it to do anything. So I might say, um, "Can you make this uh, shorter and punchier?" Okay, this is, I do this a lot now um, with anything that I've, that I've written. So I can easily then take this and say, oh yeah, I like this um, better. Um, come in here and kind of um, put it in. Um, or I could ask it to, you know, do something different um, in, in the follow-ups here. So you can, it's really easy to start working uh, with your text. Okay, so as you're writing things, having it right next to you and being able to ask it, you know, I often ask it, can you give me a metaphor for this? Can you make it sound more exciting? Um, all those sorts of things. So if you're writing in Tana, I just find it so fast and it keeps me in flow when I'm writing to be able to just open up uh, the, the panel with AI and just ask it all sorts of different questions uh, with the text that I'm working on at that time. Now, the other really fun thing um, that you can do here is you can actually um, start a new thread from this message. So if you have a lot of different messages in the chat and then you want to say, go back up and kind of um, start from a certain point, you can just hit new message and then um, ask it from there. So it kind of forgets everything else that is um, uh, that's down uh, underneath that. And uh, you can just ask it follow up questions from there. So I find that really good if I've got a really long chat and then I thought, oh, you know what? I want to go up here and kind of like diverge this um, thought. You can do that. Now, the other thing that you can do is that you can come up to any of your chats and you can actually edit them. Um, so let's say it, for, I didn't like what it uh, what it produced for me and I want to re kind of ask it the question I can actually come up here and edit and return it will delete all of the chat uh, record that you have and then you can edit whatever you asked it up here um, and you can start again now you might be wondering if you've done all of these different chats 
where do they go? Um, and the answer is they live on whatever day page that you're currently on. So um, you'll just get a little node on your day page called AI chats. You can open it up um, and you can see all of the different chats that you've been working on. If you need to open one up again um, and continue working on it, you can do that uh, just by clicking on it and you get into the chat. Now let's talk about pricing. So Tana's new AI chat feature is part of their core plan, which is $14 a month. Now, that doesn't just include all of these cool AI features. It also includes Google Calendar integration, Readwise integration, live transcription, meeting assistant, voice recording, all of the good stuff. Plus, it's the world's best outliner tool. So considering that ChatGPT alone is $20 a month for premium, you actually get way more for less if you cancelled ChatGPT and just paid for TanaCore. I reckon that's a pretty good deal if you ask me. All right, so I hope that I've significantly convinced you that having AI integrated with your note-taking and knowledge management can help you get more work done faster all while staying in the flow. And talking about being more productive in Tana, you might like to watch this next video on my three secret tips for being more productive in Tana. And as always, like this video and subscribe to the channel if you want more great content like this coming up in your feed.